Hi YouTubers, um, I just wanted to come and say hi to everyone. Um, I don't know if you can really tell, but I big chopped on yesterday. It was October 21st. Um, it was exactly a year for me. And um, this right here that I have going on right now was a uh, dry braid out that I did. And um, I don't know, I'm, I'm a little speechless. Um, I can honestly say that yesterday doing my big chop, I wasn't nervous at all. I was so ready to get it over with because I couldn't do anything with the two textures any longer. I just couldn't do it. So I did um, go to a professional and I big chopped. And basically this is what I came up with as, a, as far as right now. Um, I was able yesterday to put it into a good size puff and I have not determined um, what my curl pattern is just yet. I'm still kind of playing around with it. Um, I'm thinking I'm in the range of like 4A, 4B and a mixture. One thing I can say is that the front of my hair, just like my bang area right here, pretty much doesn't curl at all. It's wavy, but it's not a curly pattern like the rest of my hair. Um, this again was a dry braid out and I have the side pinned up. Um, the products that I used for this, um, as a moisturizer, I used uh, Jane Carter uh, Nourish and Shine. And um, I also used uh, Miss Jessie's um, Meringue. I guess that's how you pronounce it, but yeah, the Miss Jessie's Meringue. And I did this dry. And um, this is what I came up with. I did uh, two cornrows in the front and um, one on each side. And then I split the middle in half and I did three at the bottom and three in the middle to give me more volume. So um, this is how it came out. I'm pretty happy with it. Um, I definitely will be coming to y'all and kind of taking you along the trip as I experiment um, with hair products, um, with hairstyles, uh, with wash and goes, all that good stuff. I can, I'm just so excited that I finally did the big chop. I was so worried about what people would say about my hair and, you know, how people would look at me. The first day that I got it done on yesterday, when we were in the mall, I kind of was self-conscious. I kind of felt like people were staring at me, but, um, I'm okay. I'm just glad that I did it. My man loves it. He's like going crazy he loves it so the people around me love it and the people around me are supporting me and that's all that matters so um i just want to say to anyone that's transitioning or coming up to being close to a year or 14 16 18 months however long you decide to, to transition for it's your hair do you just whatever you feel comfortable with trust me you will one day wake up and say i can't take it anymore and that's when you'll cut it. And that's what happened to me. So I just wanted to come and just share that with you guys and let you know that I did big chop. I am finally 100% natural and I'm so happy. So um, I just want to say thank you to all of my subscribers, everyone that has viewed my videos. Um, I am very open to any suggestions on products. My hair is dry. I did go through the, you know, where I feel like my hair is really dry now that I've big chopped. So if you can give me any tips and tricks, please leave me some comments. Please let me know because I'm new to this and we're just all here to help each other. So um, just, you know, help me out and I will help you, whoever's transitioning, who's ever big chopped, you know, I'm here. So again, I just wanted to come and show y'all, let you know I did it, um, show you my dry braid out with my little side pinned up and, you know, my little bit of bangs that I do have. That's all I was worried about. I needed something to come in my face. So as long as I had enough to drop down in my face, I'm fine. So um, I'll put uh, a little bit of my Big Chop video towards the end, as well as I'll post a couple of pictures that I took on yesterday. And I hope that you guys enjoyed. All right. Hope to hear from you. Bye. And it's bringing me out the dark Finally I can see you